The Ant's Path Once there were ants that saw a boulder in their path. One ant noticed the large boulder and immediately began complaining about how big it was. This ant sat there, complaining endlessly about the obstacle, unable to see any other way to proceed. Soon, another ant came by and joined in, agreeing with the first ant, expressing how deep the boulder was and seeing no alternative route. Not long after, a third ant came along and, falling into the same pattern, joined the others in pondering the imposing boulder. Meanwhile, another ant approached the scene and was disheartened by the endless complaints of the other ants. This ant, however, saw potential opportunities among the spaces and holes between the boulders. The ant noticed a stick nearby that could be used to climb over the boulders and create a path on each side. Excitedly, it saw all the available options and possibilities. Returning to the other ants, it showed them the various paths that could be taken, but they were so focused on what they believed they couldn't do that they remained stuck in their complaining, with more ants joining in the chorus. The proactive ant grew confused, realizing that some ants were content to merely complain and join the group without seeking solutions. Ignoring their negativity, the proactive ant decided to take action and bravely walked in between the large boulders, finding its way to the other side. It marveled at the wonders it discovered there and came back to create a path for others to follow. First, the ant placed a stick above the boulders, allowing its fellow ants to climb up and over the obstacle. It then showed them another path by going around the boulders and returning to the starting point. Some of the ants saw the opportunities offered by these new paths and followed suit, successfully obtaining food from the other side and returning safely. However, despite the clear paths laid out before them, the first group of ants remained stuck in their negativity. Their focus was solely on what they believed they could not do, and they persisted in complaining rather than embracing the possibilities that lay ahead. The moral of the story is that it's easy to get caught up in complaining about problems without actively seeking solutions. Instead of fixating on the obstacles in our path, we should look for opportunities, think creatively, and take decisive action to overcome challenges. A positive and proactive attitude can lead us to new horizons and a better life.